essentially the way that I look at it is that Metro kind of becomes the new edge. What do you think about that? Well, I think that's a very apt characterization. I think we're seeing that uh, not just at Mobile World Congress, where Juniper raised both its profile and its game, I believe, yeah. but also we're looking at various uh, critical industry trends that are driving the Metro to becoming uh, the new edge, you know, where mm -hmm. really where all the action is going on or certainly critical portions of the action is going on. And so uh, I view it as this is where our connectivity, edge cloud hosting and service right. experience outcomes are really converging. And this includes, I think, information that we're seeing that's basically a consensus. For example, on the consumer side, uh, we see that many of them are willing to pay for a premium service, that is to have quality of experience assurances that can guarantee something like cloud gaming uh, or video uh, surveillance and things of that nature. But I think it's not just about consumers, it's certainly about the business side, the enterprise side. Absolutely. And what I think is important here is that enterprise data will be increasingly distributed throughout uh, edge clouds. In fact, by the year 2025, over half of this uh, traffic will be residing in that uh, environment. And so this is why it really becomes imperative to know what is going on with uh, Metro Cloud in terms of, for example, that we can anticipate that Metro traffic will increase by five-fold, that is 500% uh, over the next few years through 2027. So that reinforces the fact that, like, yes, this is the new edge. Metro Cloud right. is where the action is happening. And uh, this is uh, resulting in projections like uh, by the end of the decade, uh, this will be a $500 billion business. Let me rephrase that, it'll be a half trillion dollar business <laughs> by the end of the decade. So already we're talking multi-billions in the very near term. And so this is definitely a space that one, a supplier needs to bet on, but it's also yeah. a very smart, solid bet. And that's why I see the Juniper Cloud Metro portfolio is really teed up to really take advantage of these opportunities. Yeah, absolutely. You know, to follow on your comments with some additional stats that I think are interesting um, is, you know, uh, by, well, by 2022, right? We're already there. 82% of video IP traffic, um, video caching is getting distributed into Metro, right? And so we're seeing mobile data traffic, which will increase 54% by 2025. And by 2025, 30% of workloads will reside in Edge Cloud. So what you've got is you've got Metro and then you've got all of these things around it kind of feeding into it. And that's really where um, I think the key part of the value proposition there is.